Hello and welcome back to Robotech. Today we are reviewing these AliExpress controller grips for the Quest 2. If you like the video, drop a like on it. If you really like it, get subscribed. Let's get into it. So I thought I'd make a mission to find the cheapest straps I possibly could. And I found these on AliExpress for less than £3. It was like £2.70. I'll link them below so you can buy them if you want to after this review. The quality of them aren't too bad. They're quite a nice material actually. So I'll show you how to install them. And then we'll test them out and see if you should buy them or not. Right, so I've currently got these AMVR grip straps on. They're really good. If you want to see a review on them, it'll be in the card up here. So let's get these off and get these on. Probably have to change them back again straight away after, but yeah. All right, they're off. So I think we put these on. There's no instructions whatsoever. So I think we put these on using like the sort of hack method where you loop this around here. Let's try it. All right, I've got one on. I had to go back to the AliExpress page and look at the pictures because no instructions whatsoever. A con straight away is you lose this wrist strap. So if this doesn't work, your controller is gone. All right, so I can show you how to do it on camera now because I think I know how to do it. Slide your batch cover off. Slide that out. Then let's slide this into there. Put the batch cover back on, then you're left with this. So because it's for this hand, obviously that needs to go back around there. And that's with the Valkyrie face facing upwards. So we need to loop this round here, like this, through the hole. Pull it through. And then you kind of just need to guess where you need it. That was actually quite a good, a little bit tight, but not too bad. No, that's how you install them. So they're quite easy to install, but obviously it's a massive disadvantage that you lose these. Let's test them out. All right, so initial comfort wise, they don't feel the best. There's obviously no give here because it's like leather sort of stuff. The only give you got is the elastic on here, but that doesn't stretch much. So you can't really reach lower down buttons very well um the grip is quite hard to touch but yeah they just don't feel secure like i've got them tight but not too tight because if i do it any tighter i won't be able to touch any of the buttons any looser they'll fall off they're just not comfortable the actual material is comfortable but everything else is just not uh, I'm going to play a little bit of Beat Saber just to see how they feel. Like here, it's sort of like pushing this finger up too high. This one's slightly looser. But as I said, it's, yeah, it's a catch-22. You have it too loose and they're going to fall off. You have it too tight, it pushes your finger up. These new songs are crazy. You could not play them on Expert. They're almost like these, uh, these songs here. They're like one level above what they actually say compared to the rest of the songs. I love this new area, it looks all cool. So they don't feel like they're going to fall off, but they, they just don't feel good. If you don't want to invest much money and you just want to try some like straps, then they're probably, they're good just to try. Or if you just don't have much money to spend anyway, because you spend it all on buying the quest, then yeah, just, they're worth it for that. But I wouldn't say, if you could afford like AMVR or the Kiwi straps or something that's got a name brand to it, because these are completely no brand name. Because the AMVR straps, they, because they're elastic, they've got some give to them. Where well, these are just completely solid. It's very hard to talk and play Beat Saber at the same time, but not doing too bad, I suppose. And I'm interested to see if they get sweaty because of the material that they are. Like with the AMVR ones, I don't really get sweaty at all. Because of how tight this right one is, it's actually hurting my hand slightly. So that didn't go too badly. They're just the most basic straps you can have, really. The Velcro stays attached pretty well. Like that hasn't come loose whatsoever. So I'm not too concerned about them flying off. All right, so just have a quick go and let's go chopping so I can pick stuff up and let go of it.
Yeah. I feel all right for that. Even though they aren't quite secure, I'm still scared of dropping them. Well, I'm just not having the wrist strap, that's the hardest thing. Not the worst thing. Like, if you're throwing stuff, I suppose it's not too bad. No, nope. shouldn't have thrown my gun, should I? Yeah, so if picking up and dropping, they're sufficient. I'll put it that way. But throwing, I don't think it's a good idea. But if you do them tight enough, they'll be all right. And you, you have got to give them some proper force to get your hands in the right place. All right, let's do the final thoughts. All right, so now we've tested these grips out. They're not too bad. They're, they're not good, but they're not too bad. They're perfect if you're on a very tight budget. If you spent all your money, you've saved up, you bought your Quest 2, and now you want some grips, but as cheap as possible, these are your go-to, because less than three pounds, you can't really complain. I'll do my reviews on, obviously, costs to the product, if it's worth buying for the money it costs. For three pound, if you have no other grips, it's worth it. And if you can't afford any other grips, it's worth it. It's a lot better than doing the strap method, because that's just, it hurts your hand and it's not nice. This is the next step up to that. But if you can afford them, buy some AMVR or Kiwi or pretty much any name grip. So yeah, that's my final thoughts. If you've got a very tight budget, they're worth it. If you haven't, get something with a name brand to it. If you do want to buy these and you're on a tight budget, link will be in the description. If you want to upgrade slightly, I've got a link to the AMVR ones in the description as well. They are Amazon affiliate links, so if you buy them, I'll get a little kickback. Help the channel, help me out. If you like the video, drop a like on it. If you really liked it, get subscribed. Check out my channel. There'll be something that you like, I guarantee you. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.